at a general level because work involves special knowledge, practices, techniques, and relationship with others. It is key to forming who we are. So work is more than just a what, or a role, or a job. It helps to form our identity. Work is also a necessary activity. We have to do it in order to sustain our livelihood. We spend 40 to 60 hours a week working. So it's seen as a necessary activity. But just because it's necessary doesn't mean it has to be devoid of meaning. As something so prominent in our lives, we ought to strive and endeavor to make it meaningful. At the individual level, we often like to see work contributing to something beyond ourselves and the corporation, that is, giving back to society and the greater good. Meaningful work is important for the individual and the business. For the individual, it provides a sense of self-respect, self-esteem, it offers the opportunity for personal development. In a word, it provides what philosophers like to call self-actualization. At the corporate level, what psychological, sociological, and philosophical research has shown is that when employees find their work more fulfilling and meaningful, there's a greater sense of trustworthiness and loyalty, and it also increases productivity. What my consultation provides is not only an external view of the corporate culture and its structure, but a bespoke process of self-discovery. I really focus on understanding and listening to the stories that employees have to tell that account for the obstacles they face on a daily basis, whether this includes communication, or mentorship, or even a sense of social responsibility in the kind of work they do. For example, an important feature I think businesses need to think about today is the personal development of their employees. The more employees see how work figures into who they are, the more genuine their interest will be in their career. One of the things I facilitate through the process of self-discovery is helping businesses understand what existing roles and tasks and new roles and tasks organically map on to the personal development of their employees. More specific examples of this kind of engagement can be found on the blog section of my website where I discuss previous consultation work with clients.